close enough. All right, guys, I'm ready to take it to the next level with Smoothie Girl. I'm going to buy her another smoothie and then present her with her rose as a token of my affection. Then I'm going to ask her to dinner. I hope she doesn't only eat smoothies, drink smoothies, whatever. Oh, napkin guy. I actually wanted to introduce myself this time. I'm Robbie. Another one. Thanks, Robbie, for supporting my undying smoothie drinking habit. I'm Gwen. It's nice to meet you, and you're welcome. I wanted to ask you to dinner to get to know you better. You mean I can't just keep getting free smoothies? I'm totally kidding. I'm actually free tonight. Is seven okay? Uh, seven's great. I can pick you up. Okay. This is my number. Text me, and I'll give you my address. S sounds great. I'll see you soon. <laughs> oh, and Robbie? Very smooth. So I am headed to my third voice lesson of the week because you can never be too prepared. And I did hear Ari complaining to my mom about not getting any slots of voice lessons. And I feel slightly bad, but only slightly. I've been wanting to be Catherine forever. Like if this was a different role, like Ariel or one of the evil stepsisters from Cinderella, that's a different story. Those are more Ari's type, but Catherine is my role. <laughs> I don't think that having Cameron use Chelsea's mug actually did anything. She hasn't showed any signs of being sick. So what I'm gonna do is open the window to weaken her immune system. That way she's fighting the cold instead of fighting the cold. You, you get what I mean. Anson and I are here prepping to throw knuckles with buckle chuckle. There's going to be trouble. <laughs> that was really clever, Mia. Thanks, I've been working on it all day. We've got our blasters and ammo, and we're going to settle this once and for all. Ooh. Maybe I should have worked on my accuracy instead of my tough voice. Watch out, buckle chuckle. Hey, guys. Great day for some good old-fashioned nerfing, huh? Dip your darts in this, and the team with the least amount of marks wins. No headshots and no mercy. <laughs> no mercy. You were serious. Yeah, no mercy. <clears throat> no mercy. Nice match, guys. Hey, thanks. I think I uh, got you there. Yeah, it looks like you did. Nice job. <laughs> thanks. We should do this again sometime. Yeah. Oh, sorry, Mom. I'm not going to be here for dinner. I have a date. A date? With the Berry Berry girl? That's the one. You should bring her here after dinner for games, movies. You could show her your doll collection. Mom, it's not a doll collection. It's a collectible action figure set. <clears throat> I'm not bringing her here. Okay, well, have fun. So, how's your dating life, Porter? There is a cute girl in my math class, but I saw that she got a B minus on our last test, so I'm not really interested. I did just download a dating app, but it doesn't seem to be working. Have you asked out any girls from it? I don't have a lot of options on the app. Maybe I could hack the algorithm and find a way to make my profile appear more frequently to more girls. Maybe you just need a woman's touch. You should have Ari and Cameron look at it and they can maybe spice it up. I guess I could triple the probability of me having the optimal profile. Ari, it's time to go! <coughs> I feel mostly prepared, but there's still a couple of notes that I can't hit. And I tried to work with my voice teacher, but all of her slots were filled so I couldn't get in. I'm really hoping that streaming my voice will help me reach those notes. Hey, Mom. Hey, how'd it go? 
Uh, it was okay. I missed a couple notes though. Uh, and I got sick, so I sounded like Darth Vader mouth breathing during my introduction. But, I mean, they heard our first auditions and they could tell that Camry was sick, so we could still get it. How did Andrea do? She actually did really good. We're super proud of her, but she's still really new to everything, so I would not expect for her to get it. No, but we should find out tomorrow who got cast, so I just hope they want a runny nose coughing cat. <laughs> <coughs> Cough drops? Yeah. So how'd it go? You should see the other guy, right? They had better blasters, better clothes, better aim. They even had scarier voices. Five minutes felt like a lifetime. They shot a dart into my shoe. How do you even do that? I probably could have told you guys those blasters weren't very good. If you had the Nerf 11600 with laser sight and the silicone slider, what? Come on, did you guys not know that I was the 1985 national Nerf champion of the five minute battle? Who are you? Let me show you how it's done. Whoa. Are those even Nerf blasters? It's all about intimidation. Just got back from my date and it was amazing. We had dinner, we talked for hours and hours. We have so much in common. Like, I feel like we could be brother and sister. Uh, not brother and sister. Anyway, she's great, and it was great. Now all I have to do is sneak in here without mom hearing me. She'll interrogate me all night. She'll want every detail. Robbie, wake up. I want to hear about your date. Mom, it's a 5 a.m. I know, I couldn't wait. Why didn't you come tell me last night? I forgot. The date was good. Okay, good. So tell me more. Or, if you want to keep sleeping, then you can just give me her name and I'll Facebook stalk her. I'm not going to let you Facebook stalk her. It was good, and I'll keep you posted. Okay, that's fine. I'll just go get a smoothie. It's your hair. It's terrible. I know, but I can't cut it. I have a callback for a five-year project. You're trying to get dates with that hair for five years? No, they're already two years in. I just had to grow it out for three more years. Three years? With this hair? We have to do something about that. Come on, let's go. This is impossible. Okay, so what if we post old pictures of Port on his dating profile so that girls are only seeing him when he's at his peak? It's like what middle-aged people would do on their dating profiles. Hmm. Actually, that could work. Anything to increase my rate of success. I'm in the ensemble. Well, who got the part? I don't know. Hey, Andrea. You got the part. That's so awesome. Congrats. Yeah, we're both in the ensemble. Andrea, that's so awesome. We're so happy for you. Yeah, I, I guess I'll see you later. Ari, I may have signed up for all the voice lesson slots so that you couldn't practice. I'm sorry, I shouldn't have. I may have intentionally tried to get you sick like multiple times. I'm sorry. <laughs> truce. Truce. Hey guys, what about this one? No. No? No? It's alright.
I still got it. I don't believe in participation trophies, but I got you guys ice cream sandwiches. I was afraid they were going to melt, but I knew it wouldn't take long for me to wipe the floor with you. Mr. Dart, it was an honor to nerf with you. I still think I have the most intimidating voice. No, my Super intimidating.